Hey guys, Geek Teacher here, and uh, today I'm just going to give you a quick tip on making better use of YouTube while you're working in your Chrome browser. It may work in Microsoft Edge Chromium as well. I haven't tested it, but it's based on the same uh, code base, so it probably should. Um, and at the same time, putting a dig in there for uh, Ditch That Summit. R wrong way, that way. Ditch, ditch That Textbook Digital Summit run by Matt Miller um, of Ditch Up Textbook fame and also working with Casey Bell on uh, Google Teacher Podcast. If you haven't gotten into either of those podcasts, because that is a podcast as well, Ditch Up Textbook, as well as Google Teacher. If you haven't done that, get onto it. It's all Googly, um, but a lot of the stuff that you use in there can be used anywhere else. Um, and I was currently listening to your guide to amazing Google Slides and Polar PowerPoint templates from the 2020 Digital Summit today uh, with Paula uh, Martinez who uh, works with Slides Mania, and uh, it can be worked on both the Office and Google sites. Anyway, quick tip for today. So you're working and uh, in your Chrome browser and you want to be able to do other things while you're watching your YouTube video. Uh, something that you can do with other products is, or not other products, sorry, with other um, things like your uh, mobile phone and so forth is to do something called picture in picture. So much like uh, my webcam down here in the bottom right hand corner, uh, you'll see that there's a video going over the top of the other one. You can do the same with YouTube. Um, so if this works on YouTube itself, as well as embedded YouTube videos that are in there. So you get your video playing. I've got the sound turned off, but I uh, just want to show you that it does work. And to make this happen, all you need to do is right click and you get that standard YouTube video, and then right click again, and you get the Chrome video, which gives you a whole heap of things, including picture in picture. Cast means you can push it to like a Google Chromecast um, enabled device, but picture in picture, click on that, and boom, I now have that there. And it seems to have taken the place of my webcam somehow. But that's okay. So now I've got that running here in the bottom right hand corner um, and I can go and do my other work. So this is Slides Mania. So I want to have a look at Slides Mania and see what they've got. Lots of awesome stuff, by the way. Cannot talk enough about this. So there's my quick tip for today. Picture in picture. You can't really do much in this other than pause pl or play. Um, if you click on that little icon there, it takes you back to your original screen and then you get all your controls back again. Um, so you can flip through. So right click and then right click again, picture in picture. So it's two right clicks and you get this. You can move it around, you can resize it to your heart's, well, almost heart's content. I don't know what that is, like a third of the height, I guess. Um, simple resizing, uh, moving, Do uh, you can close it, pause it, and then this icon here to go back, that little arrow in a box takes you back and you're back in the main screen. Um, obviously, all your settings from in here. So I set it to 720p because I like nice clear pictures. But if you're having trouble with YouTube playing properly, you can drop it to the other one. If you have it on auto, it will use whatever your bandwidth can give you, which sometimes is a little bit less. Um, neat little trick. Set it to the quality that you want and then uh, let it cache. So it goes ahead of your video frame a little bit to pick it up if you're having trouble with that. But otherwise, there's my hints for today. Enjoy. Um, picture in picture, floating YouTube videos so you can get about doing your other work. Enjoy.